Flying cars are steadily moving from science fiction to reality. Companies around the world are developing vehicles that can drive on roads and take to the skies. Here's a look at 20 flying cars that may revolutionize transportation in the coming years. The Klein Vision flying car is a dual-mode vehicle that can be driven on roads and flown in the air. It is a two-seater aircraft with a retractable propeller and wings. The car can be transformed from road mode to air mode in under three minutes. The Klein Vision flying car is powered by a 160 horsepower BMW engine. The engine drives a fixed pitch propeller for flight and the wheels for road travel. The car has a range of 1,000 kilometers, 621 miles, and a top speed of 300 kilometers per hour, 186 miles per hour. Despite the challenges, the Klein Vision flying car is a promising technology that has the potential to transform the way we travel. I'm excited to see how this technology develops in the years to come. The Aeromobile is equipped with a hybrid propulsion system that allows it to travel up to 1,000 miles on a single tank of fuel. It can also reach speeds of up to 124 miles per hour in the air and 100 miles per hour on the road. The Aeromobile's interior is just as luxurious and comfortable as you would expect from a high-end car. It features leather seats, a spacious cabin, and all the latest amenities. The Aeromobile is not just a luxury toy. It has the potential to revolutionize transportation. It could make it possible to travel to remote locations that are currently inaccessible by car or plane. It could also reduce traffic congestion and pollution. The Aeromobile is still in its early stages of development, but it has already generated excitement around the world. It is a symbol of innovation and progress, and it represents the future of personal transportation. The PAL V Liberty is the world's first flying car. It's a three-wheeled vehicle that can both drive on roads and fly in the air. The PAL-V Liberty is a gyroplane, which means it has a rotor that spins to generate lift. This makes it much safer and easier to fly than a helicopter. To take off, the PAL-V Liberty simply needs a short runway. Once it's in the air, it can fly at speeds of up to 180 km per hour. To land, the PAL-V Liberty simply needs to find a flat spot of ground and slowly descend. It can even land on water. On the road, the PAL-V Liberty can drive at speeds of up to 160 km per hour. It can also be parked in a regular parking space. The PAL-V Liberty is a two-seater vehicle with a spacious interior. It has all the amenities you would expect from a luxury car, including air conditioning, a stereo system, and navigation. The PAL-V Liberty is still in development, but the company plans to start production in 2025. The base price of the vehicle is expected to be around 500,000 euros. Traffic congestion is a major problem in cities around the world. It wastes time, money, and fuel, and it's a major source of pollution. Two companies, Airbus and Ital Design, have come up with a new concept that could help to solve the problem of traffic congestion. It's called Pop-Up, and it's the first modular, fully electric, zero-emission concept vehicle system. Pop-Up is a modular system that consists of three components, a capsule, a ground module, and an air module. The capsule is the passenger compartment and it can be attached to either the ground module or the air module. The ground module is an electric car that can drive on roads. The air module is a drone that can fly through the air. When you want to travel you simply call up pop-up using an app. The app will tell you the best way to get to your destination, whether it's by ground or by air. If you're traveling short distances you'll use the ground module. If you're traveling long distances, you'll use the air module. Next we have the Terrafugia flying car. The Terrafugia Transition is a roadable aircraft that can be legally driven on roads and flown as an airplane. It is the first production roadable aircraft to be certified by the FAA. The Transition has a range of 500 miles and can reach a speed of 200 miles per hour. It has been praised for its ease of use and its ability to transform from a car to an airplane in just minutes. The Terrafugia Transition is a roadable aircraft that was developed by Terrafugia Inc. in Woburn, Massachusetts. The Transition is a two-seat light sport aircraft LSA, that can be folded up its wings and driven on roads like a car. The Transition can be operated by a pilot with a sport pilot license. The Terrafugia Transition is powered by a 100-horsepower Rotax engine. The engine can be used to drive the Transition on roads or to power the aircraft's propeller. The Transition's wings fold up and down in just minutes. To take off, the pilot simply extends the wings and taxi to a runway. Once the transition is airborne, it can fly like a normal airplane. Next, Terrafugia TFX flying car. The TFX is a four-seater hybrid electric vehicle that can both drive on roads and fly through the air. 
It's equipped with retractable wings and propellers that allow it to take off and land vertically, meaning it doesn't need a runway. The TFX has a range of 500 miles and a top speed of 200 miles per hour. It's powered by a combination of a gasoline engine and electric motors, which gives it the efficiency and range that we need for everyday use. The TFX is still under development, but the company behind it, Terrafugia, has already made significant progress. They've successfully tested a smaller prototype of the vehicle, and they're hoping to bring the TFX to market in the next few years. The TFX has the potential to revolutionize the way we travel. It could make it possible to commute to work in minutes instead of hours. It could also make it easier to travel to remote locations that are difficult to access by car. Next, Blackfly. The Blackfly is an electric vertical takeoff and landing VTOL aircraft that can be flown by anyone with a pilot's license. It has a range of about 40 miles and can reach speeds of up to 62 miles per hour. The Blackfly is still in development, but it has already made several successful test flights. What makes the Blackfly so special is its ability to take off and land vertically. This means that it doesn't need a runway, so it can take off and land from virtually anywhere. This makes it perfect for urban commuting, as it can take you from your doorstep to your office without having to deal with traffic. The Black Fly is also very easy to fly, the controls are very intuitive, and there is a lot of automation that makes it easy to take off, land and fly in a straight line. This makes it a great option for people who have never flown a plane before. The Black Fly is still a few years away from being commercially available, but it has the potential to revolutionize the way we travel. If you're looking for a new and exciting way to get around, then the Black Fly is definitely worth keeping an eye on. The Bellwether Flying Car is an electric vertical takeoff and landing EVTOL, aircraft. This means that it can take off and land vertically like a helicopter, but it is powered by electricity, like a car. This makes it much more environmentally friendly than traditional aircraft. The Bellwether flying car is powered by a number of electric motors. These motors are located in the wings and body of the aircraft, and they provide the thrust needed to take off, fly, and land. The aircraft also has a number of batteries that store the electricity needed to power the motors. Despite the challenges, the Bellwether flying car has the potential to be a revolutionary new vehicle. It could significantly reduce traffic congestion, provide access to remote areas, and make it easier to travel around cities. I'm excited to see how this technology develops in the future. The Samson Switchblade is the world's first street-legal flying car. This revolutionary vehicle combines the convenience of a car with the freedom of an airplane, making it the ultimate personal transportation solution. The Switchblade is a three-wheeled vehicle that can fold out its wings and tail in under three minutes, transforming it into a fully operational aircraft. It's powered by a hybrid electric system that can take it up to 200 miles per hour in the air and 125 miles per hour on the ground. The Switchblade can take off from a runway as short as 1,100 feet and land on a runway as short as 700 feet. It has a range of 450 miles on a full tank of fuel and it can reach an altitude of up to 13,000 feet. The switchblade offers a number of benefits over traditional cars and airplanes. It can help you beat traffic, save time, and avoid the hassle of airport security. It's also a more environmentally friendly option, as it emits significantly less CO2 than a traditional car. The Samson switchblade is the future of transportation. It's a versatile and convenient vehicle that can take you anywhere you want to go, quickly and easily. The Xpeng X2 is an electric vertical takeoff and landing EVTOL, aircraft. This means that it can take off and land vertically without the need for a runway. This makes it ideal for urban use as it can take off and land from rooftops or parking spaces. The X2 is also fully autonomous, meaning that it can fly itself without the need for a pilot. This makes for a safe and convenient flying experience for passengers. Safety is a top priority for Xpeng, and the X2 is equipped with a number of safety features, these include a redundant battery system, multiple sensors, and a collision avoidance system. The X2 is also designed to be able to withstand harsh weather conditions. Xpeng is working closely with regulators to ensure that the X2 meets all safety requirements. The Xpeng X2 has a number of potential use cases. It could be used as an air taxi for short-distance travel within cities. It could also be used for medical transportation, delivering goods, or even sightseeing. The X2 could revolutionize the way we travel. The Xpeng X2 is still under development but it has the potential to change the way we travel. With its safe, efficient and convenient design, 
the X2 could make flying cars a reality. The Airspeeder is a revolutionary electric flying car that is set to change the way we travel. This incredible machine is not only environmentally friendly, but it's also incredibly fast and maneuverable. In this video, we're going to take a closer look at the Airspeeder and see what it can do. The Airspeeder is powered by four electric motors that can take it from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 2.8 seconds. It has a top speed of 250 miles per hour and can reach an altitude of 5,000 feet. The Airspeeder is also incredibly agile thanks to its unique gimbal thrust system. This system allows the car to rotate and maneuver in any direction with incredible precision. The Airspeeder is not just a concept car, it's a real machine that is already being raced in a professional series. The Airspeeder EXA series is a global racing series that features pilots from all over the world competing in these incredible machines. The racing is fierce and exciting and it's sure to get your heart pounding. This incredible machine has the potential to revolutionize the way we travel. Imagine being able to take off from your backyard and fly to work in minutes, or being able to avoid traffic jams by flying over them. The possibilities are endless. The aircar concept measures 6 meters in length and is made from an ultralight carbon monocoque. It's powered by four rotatable Rolls-Royce jet engines, which give it incredible stability and maneuverability. Thanks to its 4x4 system, the aircar can maneuver on variable heights and inclines its trim depending on the cruising speed needs. This makes it perfect for navigating urban areas. The air car can accommodate one pilot and three passengers with an estimated top speed of 750 km per h for an estimated autonomy of 1200 km jet fuel. This means you could travel from New York to Los Angeles in just a few hours. The air car is still in the developing stage but it has the potential to revolutionize transportation. With its incredible speed, maneuverability and range, it could make the world a much smaller place. The VRCO XP4 is an all-electric four-passenger vertical takeoff and landing EVTOL aircraft that's designed to be a personal air vehicle. It's still in development, but it has the potential to revolutionize transportation by making it possible to travel between cities in just a matter of hours. The VRCO XP4 uses eight ducted propellers to generate lift and thrust. The propellers can rotate to provide both vertical and horizontal thrust, so the aircraft can take off and land vertically, as well as fly forward at speeds of up to 200 miles per hour. The VRCO XP4 has the potential to revolutionize transportation. It's an exciting concept that I'm sure we'll be hearing a lot more about in the years to come. The Embraer Pulse is a futuristic vertical takeoff and landing VTOL aircraft that is designed to seamlessly transition between ground and air travel. The aircraft is composed of two parts, a detachable passenger pod and a ground vehicle. The passenger pod is a transparent, all-glass capsule that can seat up to four passengers. The pod is equipped with its own propulsion system so it can take off and land vertically without the need for the ground vehicle. The ground vehicle is a six-wheeled electric car that can drive autonomously. The pod can be easily attached and detached from the ground vehicle, so passengers can seamlessly transition from ground to air travel. The Embraer Pulse is still a concept car but it is one of the most advanced and well-designed flying cars in development. The aircraft is expected to be able to travel at speeds of up to 200 miles per hour and have a range of up to 200 miles. The Embraer Pulse is a truly revolutionary concept that could change the way we travel. It has the potential to make air travel more accessible and affordable, and it could also help to reduce traffic congestion in cities. The Stratosfera Volatile is an electric vertical takeoff and landing EVTOL vehicle that can accommodate up to two passengers. It is made of an ultra-light carbon fiber sphere and is powered by four double rotors pushed by a dual electric engine. This gives it a range of up to one hour at max speed. There are many potential benefits to the Stratosfera Volatile. It is a zero emissions vehicle, which means that it does not produce any harmful pollutants. It is also very quiet, which makes it ideal for use in urban areas. Additionally, the Stratosfera Volatile is very easy to use, as it can be controlled with a joystick. The Stratosfera Volatile is still in the development stage, but it is expected to be available in the next few years. The company behind the Stratosfera Volatile jet capsule is currently working on obtaining the necessary certifications from the FAA and other aviation authorities. I believe that the Stratosfera Volatile has the potential to be a game changer in the transportation industry. It is a clean, quiet, an easy-to-use vehicle that could revolutionize the way we travel. I am excited to see the Stratosfera Volatile become a reality in the years to come. The Icon 
A5 is a light sport aircraft that combines the thrill of flying with the convenience of landing on water. That's right, this isn't just a plane, it's also a boat. With its folding wings and retractable landing gear, the A5 can seamlessly transition from land to water and back again. The Icon A5 is designed to be easy to fly and operate even for those with no prior aviation experience. It features a simple and intuitive cockpit layout, as well as a number of safety features that make it a very forgiving aircraft. Whether you're looking for a weekend getaway, a quick business trip, or just a chance to experience the thrill of flight, the Icon A5 is the perfect aircraft for you. It can be used for a variety of purposes including recreational flying, fishing, camping, and even commuting. The Icon A5 is just the beginning of the future of personal transportation. As technology continues to advance we can expect to see even more innovative and practical flying cars in the years to come. The Archer Midnight Evtol Flying Car This sleek and sophisticated aircraft is designed to revolutionize the way we get around, offering a fast, efficient, and environmentally friendly way to travel. The Midnight Evtol can carry up to four passengers and a pilot, and it has a range of up to 100 miles. It can take off and land vertically, meaning it doesn't need a runway, and it's powered by electric motors, so it's emissions-free. The Midnight Evtol has the potential to transform our cities. It can help to reduce traffic congestion, improve air quality, and connect people and places in ways that were never before possible, the Archer Midnight. Evtol is still in development, but it has the potential to change the way we live and work. With its sleek design, advanced technology, and potential to revolutionize urban transportation, the Midnight Evtol is the future of flight. The Norte Glider is a two-seater electric-powered flying car that can take off and land vertically. It has a range of up to 1,000 miles and can reach speeds of up to 200 miles per hour. The glider is still in development but it has already made several successful test flights. The Norte Glider uses a combination of electric motors and propellers to generate lift and thrust. The propellers are located on the wings and tail of the car, and they can be tilted to provide vertical lift for takeoff and landing. The glider also has a battery pack that stores the energy needed to power the motors and propellers. There are many potential benefits to the Norte Glider. It could help to reduce traffic congestion and pollution in cities. It could also make it easier and faster to travel between different cities and towns. And it could even open up new possibilities for travel, such as commuting to work from a remote location. There are also some challenges that need to be addressed before the Norte Glider can become a reality. One challenge is the cost of the car. The glider is expected to be very expensive, which could put it out of reach for most people. Another challenge is safety. Flying cars have the potential to be very dangerous, so it is important to develop strict safety regulations before they can be widely used. The Aston Martin Volante is a stunning car both inside and out. The sleek aerodynamic design is sure to turn heads wherever you go, and the interior is just as luxurious with plenty of space and top-of-the-line amenities. But what really sets the Volante apart is its ability to fly. The car has four propellers that allow it to take off and land vertically, and it can even cruise at speeds of up to 250 miles per hour. The Aston Martin Volante is packed with cutting-edge technology. The car is powered by a hybrid electric system that's both efficient and powerful, and the car is also equipped with a number of autonomous features that make it easier to drive. The Aston Martin Volante is a truly amazing car. It's a symbol of luxury, innovation, and the future of transportation. I can't wait to see what the future holds for this incredible vehicle. Flying cars are still in their early stages of development, but there is a lot of potential for them to change the way we live. I'm excited to see what the future holds for flying cars, and I hope that they will one day become a reality. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel for more content.